heat is coming. And that means it's time to get our ass axes out and fitting crampons on our boots. A lot of boots on the market there nowadays that have a curved sole. And obviously the crampon will have to match that sole to get the ultimate performance out of it. So today's video is on uh, how we fit a curve bar on a group wear attack crampon. Let's see how that's done. So here we are. This is the grip wear attack crampon. It comes with a standard bar like this. It's got the um, anti boiling plate. Basically it gets pressed in and it wants to press it back out. So you don't get any snow stuck in your crampons. So I'll show you guys. Um, I've got the Scarpa Manta over here. It's got a curved uh, sole on it. I'll put the crampon on show you how it sits you can see it's it's slightly slightly off over here slightly off center that's not what we want for uh, ultimate uh, performance so we're gonna fit the curved bar on it and I'll show you how to do that so we're gonna be fitting so basically taking it apart we'll declip it from the back it comes off and then slide the bar through the front. There you go. That's that off. Now with the curved bar, if you slide it through like the other one came through, you can see right at the front it won't want to go past this little nugget over here. So with the curved bar, what you want to do is you want to come in from below. There's two slots, we'll just go in the one. Don't worry about it, um, it will be all rigid when it's all put together. So you come through, boop, pull it tight, and it's in. Then we go put the bar in the slot on the back, lift the pin up, and click the pin in place. So now we'll fit the cramp on, on the boot, put the boot in on the back, clamp it up, boom, and now you can see sits nicely with the sole it curves along with it so that's how we do it fairly straightforward well if you don't know it's uh, a bit complicated <laughs> well yeah that's how we do it so yeah, that's how you change a curved bar when I grip wear that cramp on uh, I tried looking for a video like that myself when I bought them couldn't find anything so I thought we will uh, make one so if you like this video please give us a like and a subscribe uh, we'll try and do more of these tutorial videos or informational videos <laughs> however you want to call it uh, thank you all for watching and i uh, hope to catch you on our next adventure